We found some stuff out. An ice-capped mountain looms over the world from far above the clouds. That is the place from which this burgeoning darkness proceeds. Ice-capped mountain? Is that all? It's a really, really high mountain that no one's ever seen before, and it's super cold up there. The sleepers are forced to try and climb to the summit, but they don't know why. Climb the mountain to the summit. What sort of person would wish to reach the summit of that mountain? And how is their desire strong enough to exert an influence on others? Perchance some poor soul lies there, buried in the snow, hounded to death on the mountain. Or some intrepid explorer was exceptionally keen to conquer that particular mountain. Oh, I'll do another reading. Aha! Uh -huh. I see something here. It's a little vague, but I think I can get his name. Ah, uh, yes! Leonard. Wow, that was fast. Well, in case you'd forgotten, I am a genius. Leonard. Paimon's never heard that name before. Hi! Uh. Sounds interesting. Mind if I join you? What ho? We meet again, vagrant of Inazuma. <laughs> My retinue and I were just... The first time the Millilith were present, I had to forego the chance to strike down Mondstadt's savior. This time was a perfect moment. I was mere seconds away. But who was that mage? She could not have known who I am. Perhaps her powers revealed to her things unseen. Soldiers! Sir! Sir! Find them, and when you do, Another one? My lord! Ugh. It's happening again. This is the largest one we've seen so far. They just keep coming. But so be it. Move out. Change of plan. Your prior objective remains in force. Continue to research the meteorites. My lord, leave them to us. We will make short work of them. Are you deaf or just stupid? When did I give you the right to issue your own orders? My, my apologies, my lord. Now move out and complete your objectives as assigned. Any junior fortune teller could have told you this, but that man was a Fatui harbinger. That was too close. How did you manage to get caught up with a guy like him? A Fatui Harbinger? Why, their wickedness knows no bounds. Whatever he was planning to do, he was heading straight for you. And he is an extremely powerful individual. I sensed it the moment I looked at him. He's far more powerful than you'd imagine. As much as it pains me to admit it. Surely his power cannot match that of the astrological genius of the century. I never said that. His strength may exceed mine by a hair's breadth, but in astrology alone, he doesn't come close. <gasps> this reminds Paimon of something. We ran into some Fatui at Wangshu Inn too. What interest could the Fatui have in the meteorites? They must be plotting something. <sighs> Maybe. Just...
Just maybe. Oh! The Fatui are the ones who caused the meteor shower in the first place. Was that it? Paimon, that was my line. Get your own. Sorry. Paimon's mouth just works so much faster than everyone else's. Yeah. Where'd they get the power to pull stars out of the sky? Osvaldo Hafnavines, what is thy opinion? I think that anything is possible, main Fräulein. So long as they can afford to pay the price, they will never stop sowing their seeds of destruction across the land. Fatui, your sin shall not go unremembered. I also believe that miracles can happen. Astral Emissary, you have performed admirably as a member of my retinue. Batch my forces to protect you, and they will ensure that the encroaching darkness shall bring you no harm. She means... me. No need! Paimon thinks that our current lineup works just fine. No need to fix it if it ain't broke. You underestimate me, Fischl. I'm far stronger than you seem to think. Main Fräulein trusts no one more than yourself, my lady. She is simply concerned for your well-being. There's really no need. In any case, you're in a much more perilous position than I am. If anything, you need my protection. <laughs> Naturally. For now, we must deal with the new threat. My astrolabe tells me that a new meteorite has landed, and it's the biggest one yet. Looks like we made it here before the Fatui. Quick! There's no time to lose! This is the one. I sense an unprecedented amount of elemental energy within. The very heart of darkness descends upon the world. What do the Fatui want with this? Is it the elemental power? It's possible. But if that were the case, other life forms would surely be drawn to the meteorite's energy, too. Yeah. 
You can't run from death. 